Hey, Salah, how you doing? Hey, Damon, how are you? Not too bad. So, um, you know, uh, you you reached out to the uh, to the the uh, coaching group here and asked if somebody could come and talk to you about Agile. Um, mm. How can I help? Yeah, uh, you know, I'm I'm gonna start with my new uh, is it with a new company and and I just want to uh, understand Agile better. You know, it's just you know, there's so many, so many uh, flavors out there and it's hard to figure out which one works. And I'm going to be uh, managing a lot of different teams and, and then people and, you know, just trying to pick a framework that, that makes it, you know, um, easy to, or, or more, um, you know, effect, effective, or, or and efficient for for us to deliver. So, it you know when I do some research, I I just can't make sense of it at all. It's like you know, okay. this framework here, this framework, this is better. This is no that that's better. Um, well, you've but, come to the right place, Salah, because like I can tell you which ones are good and which ones are really not that good. And, um, you know, I, I can definitely come up with something for you. Okay. That, that, that sounds, uh, that sounds good. Um, but I, th I, I saw this, uh, I think it, this framework, uh, that has really everything that I, that I could think of. It's, it's like this scaling framework that is, you know, that has every role under the sun that we need to. Uh, have and I think it might be a good fit for for our company. Oh, yeah, that that's that's probably safe. It is. It's is it safe? I mean, I I don't know. You tell yeah. me. Yeah, yeah. There's there's one called Scaled Agile Framework. Oh, okay. So yeah, it, that's yeah. that's really not a that's really not a place to to start. Um, what are some other things that you've been thinking about? Uh. I think just to you know, um, well, but that that safe is just to go back to that safe um, oh, okay. framework. It has really, you know, nice, you know, um, nice, very good picture with all the different, you know, events and things that we need to do, and I think that will be that will be really good for everyone to understand because other things are very they're not as defined mm -hmm. and it may create a lot of confusion and i don't want to well, have confusion I, I so if you're looking for something that has a nice picture and it's well defined uh you should consider scrum at scale i think that'll mm -hmm. bring a lot of what you're looking for have have you had a chance to look at that uh I haven't. Well, I maybe I did. I am not sure. I don't remember exactly. But um, I was looking at a bunch of different frameworks. But you know, Safe was one. Um, yeah, I think I I I did have a look at that as well. So oh, excellent, good. excellent, mm -hmm. good, good. All right. Um, well, let's let's get into like some of your criteria. What sort of criteria are you looking for? There's there's uh, the big picture, which is obviously a good criteria. And then there's uh, something very clear, which, you know, that makes sense as well. What what other sort of criteria are you looking for? Uh, criteria for uh, what supports multiple teams, because, you know, there are a lot of different teams that are doing coordination and they're working on many different things. And it gets, you know, it gets out of hand, you know, to have to uh, to be able to connect to those uh, or coordinate these teams, so it needs to have that, you know, a way to coordinate. Well, actually, let me stop people. you there for a minute. So that right, getting back to Scrum at scale, Scrum at scale basically, you know, Scrum is for each team, and then the Scrum at scale is absolutely built built for multiple teams, and mm -hmm. then like on unlike Safe, for instance, uh, it sort of scales fractally. Right, so mm -hmm. you can have uh, teams of teams of teams, and it feels to me like that would be perfect for you. Mm. 
Yeah, I think it sounds uh, interesting. I, I, I think it, I, um, it, uh, you know, could be worth looking into further. Um, I, I do the the main thing I like about the other the safe is that it just gives you this very, you know, step by step. You know, mm -hmm. um, you know, you do this and then that and then this and then that and then. So that that it just gives people more comfort that or or sort of like yeah they know uh, we know what's going to happen next. Okay. Uh, well, you you came to me looking for some opinions and advice. So uh, you know, it sounds like you're very interested in safe, but but where's maybe some hesitation there? Uh. Hmm. Yeah, I hear some, you know, a lot of uh, feedback about that, you know, say if it's not really, it's it could be very uh, rigid, not flexible. So I, I, I don't, I don't know if that's true or, you know, I haven't oh, yeah. used oh, it. It's, it's definitely true. It's definitely true. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, well, with that in mind, it, it feels like... Uh, you know, we've, we've sort of talked this through and, uh, you know, they're safe, but I, I really think you should take a look at Scrum at Scale and mm -hmm. maybe take a look at that. And then if you have any follow-up questions, we can schedule another meeting. What do you think? Uh, yeah, that, that sounds like a good idea. Um, I, I need to just do sort of comparison, see what, what makes the most sense. Uh, and then maybe next time we can you know, talk through it more. All right, sure. I'll send you some Scrum at Scale uh, reference materials and videos as well. Okay, great. Take it easy, Salah. All right.